Hello Aries, you got the most views out of the fire sign. So I'm doing a quick bonus love reading. It'll be a general love reading. So as always, it will not resonate with every Aries watching. So let's get right into it, spirits. Angels, guys, what messages do you have? Ooh. For Aries and love. Messages for Aries regarding love. I'm gonna do a quick past, present, future spread. And maybe some advice, yeah, for Aries. In the past, we have the Six of Wands reverse, Hangman reverse in the present, Knight of Pentacles in the near future. Nice, some sort of offer for you here, Aries. Um, an offer that's taken a long time. The Knight of Pentacles takes forever to arrive because they are focused on kind of doing things right working on the details that kind of thing bottom of the deck two of wands okay interesting so let's clarify hangman reverse this is someone who is either unable to let go of something or doesn't want to let go of something because they don't really want to sacrifice um, this is also a card about not being able to see a situation from a different perspective. You're only able to see it through one perspective. So we'll clarify that to see. Now with the past here, I have the Six of Wands reversed. So something clearly hasn't worked out when it comes to love here. So let's see what this is about. So help me clarify. If I could shuffle, that'd be great. For Aries, please. Why is the Six of Wands reverse? The Emperor reverse. Well, there you are, Aries. Not very happy. The Emperor reverse. Someone that doesn't really feel like they have a lot of control over a situation. Um, they tend to try to be a little too forceful. Aren't able to really bring back something like back into order so let's see what else or it could be someone that's just pissed off king of cups wow this was someone you loved or had feelings for here what else can you tell me about the six of wands reverse knight of swords so some sort of communication or conversation took place here. I feel like some maybe it was some sort of truth that came in. Wow, I got the fool at the bottom. It could have been um, some sort of, I don't know. The, the Knight of Swords tends to come in hot without really thinking of the delivery of what they're saying. Um, they're not the best communicators because they're so focused on just delivering the truth. That they don't really care how they deliver it or don't really think about how they deliver it. So I think that there was some something that happened here in the recent past where there was some sort of communication or truth that came to you or that you discovered or a conversation that took place where it's almost like something wasn't successful because of it. I feel like someone maybe were, was trying to control a situation or the outcome of a situation and it didn't work out. And I think this is someone that you had feelings for here. Tell me more about this Knight of Swords. Tell me more about this Knight of Swords, please. The Devil Reverse, Capricorn Energy, coming out of some sort of unhealthy situation, becoming free of an unhealthy, toxic environment, Hmm. Some of you, Aries, probably were just thinking about getting out of this situation. Bottom of the deck, death reverse, Scorpio energy, seven of pentacles reverse. So it's almost like, interesting, it's almost like someone didn't want things to, was resisting this ending. I don't know if it was you or the other person you were dealing with. 
But I feel like some of you, for the Aries that I'm talking to, it's almost like you gave this person too many chances or you waited too long for something to improve and it, it didn't. the tower and the two of cups reverse so i have a feeling that things just didn't work out this could have been a separation for some of you yeah i feel like there was some sort of like disconnect here why is the hangman reverse that's too many why is the hangman reverse yep ten of swords there was some sort of ending that took place here some sort of separation maybe you felt lied to or deceived six of cups so this could have been an ex partner something that was from the past maybe this is a situation that happened in the past but you can only see it through one lens or someone is um, still thinking about the past in some way in the in the present moment tell me more about this hangman reverse Three of Swords Reverse and the Hermit Virgo Energy. Someone's really thinking about what happened in the past here or what happened with an ending. It could have been a third party situation, some sort of interference that got in the way. This Devil Energy could be addictions, it could be another person, family member, trust issues, etc. It could be anything that got in the way here. I feel like someone's really thinking about it because these two cards came out together trying to figure out what to do with the information or with the situation that's taking place here. Bottom of the deck, judgment, reverse. So I feel like someone's really thinking about a mistake. A mistake or, or the outcome of something, of a choice that they made and how it ended badly. This is a bad ending, the Ten of Swords. And I feel like I don't know. It's it's like this may, maybe this was a connection that was really special to you or maybe this is a situation Aries where you uh, have been back and forth with this person. But then I have here, oh, okay, I have the 7 of wands. Then I have here the Knight of Pentacles reverse. I mean, not reverse in the near future. <laughs> the Knight of Pentacles in the near future position. So I feel like there's some sort of offer coming here why is the knight of pentacles here for aries why is the knight of pentacles here the full reverse i thought that was maybe two cards the full reverse tell me about the knight of pentacles that is way too many but i have here how oh, shall i just take those Knight of Cups reverse and the higher font reverse. And then I have the Eight of Cups at the bottom. Taurus energy with the, uh, the higher font reverse. Knight of Cups reverse, the full reverse. I don't think that this is an offer that you m might be willing to accept. Aries. Why is the Knight of Cups reverse? The moon reverse. I feel like this person that comes to make you this offer, I feel like you're gonna, you're not gonna trust what they say. The moon reverse and two of wands. Two of wands at the bottom here as well. So I feel like there's some sort of choice that you're gonna have to make when this offer shows up, Aries. Like, take it or leave it. But with the moon reverse, it's like you can see this situation very clearly with new eyes with a very clear vision. It's almost like um, whatever was confusing before about this connection, you know exactly what's going on now. And so I don't think you're gonna just jump in and accept this offer. Why is the higher font reverse? Broken commitment. Um, someone that is rebelling. This could be somebody that's rebelling against what's expected of them. And so they're taking a big risk bringing you this offer. Yeah, see? Seven of uh, Swords Reverse. This is something that I feel like... I don't know. There's something off about this offer. Chariot, Cancer Energy, moving forward, moving on. This person could come see you. Yeah, to make you this offer. This person, I feel like, is someone that's at a distance from you in some way. These two cards 
are cards about distance. And then these two cards are cards about revelations, things coming to light, people getting caught. Um, Knight of Cups reverse with these three these three cards together, it's like something's off about what this person is offering you. Either they're telling you exactly what you want to hear or they're not telling you everything. Maybe they're avoiding a certain situation. Maybe they don't want things to end between you, so they're coming to tell you whatever it is they need to tell you. Um, I feel like there's still going to be some sort of choice when this person comes to you. Like you're going to have to decide to accept this offer from them or are you going to just move on? This person could come to see you. I mean, expect them, I feel like. They're probably coming to try to fix the damage of what's going on back here. And they're going to do that with some sort of offer here with the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, look, Tower. It's like you're not really expecting this. Um, maybe they're going to surprise you. It's a surprising visit. But, you know, I feel like you already kind of know in the back of your mind whether you're going to accept this or not. All right, Aries, let's see if this is resonating for you. Leave me a comment down below. Tell me how it's resonating. I love hearing from you. Let's see what advice spirit has for you. Any messages or advice for Aries? Spirits, angels, guides. Any messages or advice for Aries? Okay, we got no with an exclamation mark. And then bottom of the deck, communicate clearly. Exactly. I feel like you're going to want more answers than what you're getting or your initial response is going to be a no maybe there needs to be more open and honest communication before you give this person a chance but um i feel like the choice will be yours all right aries i'll leave it there hopefully this resonated for you if it did leave me a comment let me know hit the like button subscribe share and comment if you enjoy the readings and i'll see you in another video take care